hey welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to switch from hosting or builder back to wordpress let's begin now the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials if you haven't already you'll need to set up your wordpress account here just create by continuing with your google your apple your github you can use your business or working email address and by following the on-screen instructions you are all set now we are going to do the same in hostinger i suggest you click on the migrate now option or just log in using your credentials and from there we are going to access the main dashboard okay so there are several reasons why someone might consider switching from a website builder like hostinger to wordpress because i believe that wordpress offers much more flexibility in terms of design functionality with thousands of themes and plugins available you can customize your website to a greater extent compared to hostinger's builder now with wordpress you have complete ownership and control over your website you are not tied to a specific platform or hosting provider giving you more freedom in the long run now from here all you have to do is simply go to the now this is going to be the next step just open the website section and click on the add website or the migrate website as you can see you're going to be having a lot of options from here and we are switching back to wordpress right and obviously all we have to do is just press on the wordpress option here because we are going to have a flexible customization for diverse needs all right just click on the wordpress and from there just click on the profile icon right here at the upper right corner and select migrate website and then from here all you have to do is just click on add request in other cases you will be presented with the migration request form and select the control panel you need from migration from say for example it's going to be hostinger going back to wordpress and of obviously you need to fill out the required information according to the type of control panel all right now if you are lost during the whole navigation process or having problems or difficulties switching from hostinger builder back to wordpress what you need to do is simply just go here at the hostinger contact support because from there they are more than glad to assist you if you encounter any issues switching back from hostinger builder back to the wordpress you can chat with the customer service team and these are the channels that you can reach them all right now alternatively just hover to your wordpress website and you might want to go to the search option and type in hostinger and hit enter and from here as you can see there's a lot that you can do because you can use the hostinger's onboarding plugin transforms the way you launch a wordpress site crafted for an effortless user experience and from here all you have to do is just upgrade and activate and you will have an option to integrate seamlessly with wordpress and hostinger you can also do the same thing here in pro plugins just search for hostinger hit enter and then and again all you have to do is just click on hostinger and you have four sections here the details because of this plugin transforms the way you launch a wordpress site the reviews that will help you make an informed decision the minimum installation guideline and the active community of contributors and developers and from here just click on the download and i believe that's a wrap for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you in the next one